Hey everyone, what's going on? So the floating window feature in MIUI device seems to have a lot of problem. I've already made two videos on how to fix the floating window feature not working in MIUI and POCO devices, but it seems it's not enough. Recently I came across this new problem in a POCO device where the floating window feature is not working. Like when you open an app, it shows that it's supposed to floating window, but when you try and open an app in the recent app straight, it's just not there, like the feature doesn't even exist, and neither do you get that floating icon where you can select an app to open in the floating window. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can fix this issue and how you can use the floating window in your POCO device or whatever device you have and it's not working. So stick to the video and don't forget to like and subscribe. So to fix the problem, the first thing you have to do is turn off the MIUI optimization from the settings. And if you've already tried it and it's not working, I'll show you a second step but for those who haven't, all you have to do is open the settings and here you need to click on about phone and then here you need to click on MIUI version a multiple times until you get a toast like you are now a developer. Once you get this toast, head back to the main setting and then scroll down and here in the additional settings you see a new option as developer options. Just click on it and scroll all the way down. Now at the bottom of this page you will see an option as turn off MIUI optimization. And if you don't find that option here, don't worry, all you have to do is click on reset to default values a few times and you will see the MIUI optimization option magically appears. And once it's there, all you have to do is turn it off and you'll see this amazing warning that tries to save you from this cruel world. So you just need to click on accept because you know you want to be safe. And now head back and check if it's working or not. If it's working, it's great, just leave a like on the video and you don't need to watch the video anymore. And if it's not working for you, then you have to go through the pain of rebooting your phone. So after rebooting, if you still don't find the floating window option in the recent app tray, then this is a software issue. So check if you have any software update available and install it. But meanwhile you can still use the floating window from the notification or the control center. So open the control center and here you will find an icon as floating window. And if you don't find the icon here, just click on this edit button and from here you can add the floating icon. So just add it in your quick setting and then open the app that you want to use in the floating window. And then from the control or notification center you can use the app in the floating window. So that's it for today's video, I'll keep you posted if there's another fix available and if you find this video helpful don't forget to like and subscribe.